All right, here we go, part nine, guys. We're now uh, setting the RA right through the port. So we've done the roof. Uh, now we're going to the bowl, so we're going to blend back down and do the short turn at the same time. Um, and the key here is use your fingers and just feel the, uh, the surface. Make sure we don't have any undulations in the surface. If you do, just flutter it over it until, again, the, the sanders aren't really a shaping. They're more of a texture thing, but you can shape um, if you um, use a nice, fresh piece. And the other thing I'll say too, when using a cartridge roll, dull the edge on a bit of aluminium or on a block or something and just knock the sharpness off it. That way it doesn't leave lines in your port. Uh, and keep your worn ones. So they come in real handy when you're doing the bowls around the guide. You can pop the used ones on because they usually got a nice worn shape there and you can shape the bowls a little, little bit better. So I'll show you where we're at at the moment. And this is uh, doing the bowls and um, yeah. So here it is just cutter finished and I'll show you the other port. We've already done one. Just to give you an idea, and as you can see, the texture's finished it off really, really well there with the cartridge roll. I think that's an 80 grit. So we'll hit these now, uh, sand them all up. And as you can see, I've got to do this one now. And I'll just show you the procedure. That's our cartridge roll. We're only using this at about 11,000. And just keep it moving nice and quickly. Um, you don't need a lot of pressure. Uh, and flutter it around. If there's any uh, ridges or stuff, just flutter over the top of the ridge until it um, works its way level uh, and then just continue to feel the port and make sure uh, you're not putting any deep lines and stuff in it and again I always sort of like to work between that 10 and 30 degrees on, on the actual cartridge roll this stops the um, delamination so if you work it parallel and start to heat the back of the cartridge roll up where it's glued it'll actually unroll and um, basically explode in the port and come loose we don't want to do that so always stay off the back of the cartridge roll and, and don't chuck these out just keep them as you use them if they're getting a little bit long in the tooth um, meaning they're not not um, sanding well change them up but keep your other ones because they're they, they'll because they've gone off a little bit they're much smoother so if you want to come in and do a really really light transition they're very very good for that and just watch them on the divider because they do catch and I think yeah right there uh, it caught me and it'll start to tear the cartridge roll apart so sometimes I'll go right through stay away from the divider then come back with my used ones and just shake that up because it will tend to eat them up a little bit that's an area that uh, people tend to get caught uh, especially if you're trying to get a really really nice line on that divider which all of our cylinder heads I like to do so yeah just just watch that area and um, yeah, just continue to keep it moving you don't want to sit it in for too long and being small diameter these are only three eight so they will trench very easily if you if you're running them up and down the port in the same area so just just be very careful of that because i see a lot of cylinder heads come in there they're deeply trenched and they've got all sorts of ruts in them um because people aren't moving the the uh, cartridge roll fast enough or they're just using too much pressure in a consistent area so I like to keep it moving um, and keep the pressure fairly even and, and just work the port so that's basically it as you can see it doesn't take terribly long uh, you're probably going to spend uh, two or three minutes on each floor and this is the bowls now we've done the same you can really see those uh, divider shapes now are a lot better and it's got cast guides in it so we can't go crazy with the cast guides but that's uh, pretty close for what it is now